Stella Uluwaye Missy Shola, the Vice President won of Anupa. I would say fantastic. It was indeed a success. The turnout was good. Even those who joined virtually, the turnout, one can confidently say, was good. So I'm happy that uh, we were able to do this for our junior colleagues. They have learned a lot. The topics were quite interesting, uh, enriching, educating, and it's been fine. It's been fine, and um, I'm sure we'll keep improving as, as we go on. Yes, my advice is that they should take in everything. The topics handled at this workshop, I would say, are very, very good topics. And that, those are the topics you would need as you grow in the, in the system. You should be able to write minutes. You should be able to write reports. You should be able to conduct yourself in the manner of a professional administrator. And once you are able to learn that from now, of course, by the time you become run and then you would have been grounded in the system, you will definitely be a good administrator, one that people will also look up to. So it's good. From the beginning, let's groom them. From the beginning, let's show them the way. From the beginning, let's make them comfortable that they are not in the wrong profession, but they should do things right. Okay. In Nigeria now, I want to believe we have about 215 universities. And um, regularly, the number is increasing. Universi private universities have been established, federal universities have been established. My concern is this. Yes, those universities are not enough. Good. My brother in the village needs university education not only for the people in the urban areas, I agree. But the existing ones, let's make them functional. Let government sit down with uh, stakeholders and readdress the issues. There are a number of things we can do to improve the system. Let's come together to discuss. It's not going to be a jamboree, but conscious effort to ensure that things get better. So I still believe the government should invite the stakeholders to a round table for a round table discussion. It is what you have that you can give. It is what you have that you can give. If the equipment in the laboratories, if the ICT, uh, ICT provision made available in the schools are working effectively, the professor is ready to work because not enough is being pumped into research. Research is not done on credit. It's not done on gratis. You have to spend money to make money. The environment must be conducive. The equipment must be there. The government must be involved, must see it as a project. If you see agri as a project, why not education? If you take care of the farmers, why don't you take care of the teachers? Why don't you take care of the institution? Why don't you take care of everybody that works there? So that things can be better. Would you go into an agreement you know you cannot fulfill. If I've been issued, sorry, this is what we are able to give. If there had not been an agreement, there won't be this issue. But there is an agreement to always refer to. If you want to renegotiate an agreement, it's not done this way. And this agreement has to do with lives of people. Students are back home, teachers are home, SANU members, we are not happy being at home. We want to do what we know how best to do. Don't forget that we are still going to do the work. We are going to do the work. Government is not going to hire other people to do the work and then pay us and pay those who should take responsibility for this don't have their children there. My, my, my children schooled in Nigeria. They schooled in Nigeria, though they went for their masters in different destinations. But that first degree, that's the policy in my family. So their first degree was in Nigeria. And I don't see why it cannot be better. After all, in those days, 
a whole chicken you will eat in UI when you get to the cafeteria. When you tell them the story now, they don't want to hear it. The government take come up with policies that can help the situation the way it is. You know, you cannot use the same method you used 70 years ago in 2022. Let there be a roundtable discussion to look at the policies and see what can be done. Some people are saying school fees should be introduced. I, I won't subscribe to that because there are a lot of people who would need this education that will not be able to afford it. So we should give those ones the opportunity too. And that's why you, are, you have the private universities. So the rich take their children there. But when there is strike, the children of the poor suffer because their own children are not there. So there should be a policy review so that, okay, this is 2022, this is what can work.